Hello everyone, welcome back to Recommend Innovations, and today I'm going to be reviewing Atlas Zephyr. So Atlas Zephyr is a right Finnish defense type. Um, he used to have a barrier gimmick with the old prototype um, for the Atlas version, but now that has changed. And so has the driver changed because I thought it was a bit too aggressive for a defense type. So yeah, let's get on here the parts. The first part is the core that has a fused sublayer. This is Zephyr. Uh, the Zephyr core has a large plate underneath it. For a, it's good for defense, and also this free spinning. Uh, it has its tie. I mean, it has this turntable, which makes any driver that goes on it free spin, like this one. Anyways, this is the uh, contact layer which is Atlas. The Atlas uh, contact layer feature, features two smooth points and then one, then two other points that have a st stud for some attack. So, put this on. As you can see, the subcontact, the subcontact layer aligns perfectly with these points. Then putting this on. This driver is called Metal Eternal. It has a free spin metal plate. And, uh, yeah. It's Eternal Metal because, well, it has metal, obviously. It, th the name sounds weird. I know. Eternal Metal sounds kind of strange. But it's fine. It performs pretty well. Anyways, right, on, on to the stadium. Test launch for air. Atlas Zephyr, three, two, and go, shoot. So as you know, that's not what a stem driver is supposed to do. But it's metal, so it's obviously gonna go crazy. So yeah. Oh uh, yeah. So now it's almost done on stamina. And now set on stamina. Um, test battle against diverse Bahamas. Rip. Let it rip. Surprisingly, that was Zephyr versus Magma Belial Dash. Three, two, and go shoot. Go shoot. Three, two, one, go shoot. Three, two, one, go shoot. Well, that was Atlas Zephyr. And if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Sparking Innovations out.